We see deuterium and tritium nuclei encountering each other at high velocity. These two positively charged nuclei must collide with enough force to overcome their mutual electrostatic repulsion. When they come within the range of their powerful nuclear binding forces, they will fuse together, forming a helium nucleus called an alpha particle and releasing an energetic neutron. The neutrons stream outward through the compressed fuel, carry implosion again. The resulting cascade of fusion reactions will sweep through the fuel before the inward moving pellet ball can decelerate and fly apart. Five, four, three, two, one, fire. Injected into the vessel through a gap in a molten lithium shower, reaches the center as the laser is fired imploding the pellet and igniting the fuel. Most of the energy from the fusion burn is captured by the lithium and converted to heat that drives conventional steam turbines and electrical generators. In addition, some of the lithium will be converted by neutron bombardment to tritium needed for fuel. Advanced concepts using only deuterium are being explored, but the first fusion power plants will most